Hey, what's up guys, it's Roy here. So today let's look at the Spigen 01 case here. Now I've already done a review of the darker colored one, but a lot of people requested the white color version here that you can see. This is gonna cost you around 20 bucks on Amazon with Prime Shipping. And as you can see, it is a nice clear case that does have obviously a lot of the graphics there that's gonna help uh, one, make the case look super cool, kind of looks like a um, nothing phone one. But then looking on the interior, you can see the actual MagSafe rings there. And then it does have the air cushion technology in it, which it does say right there. Um, but there it is, very simple. So let's grab my 15 Pro here and slap it on. So install, pretty simple, nothing too crazy. And there it is installed. So looking at it here, you can see that we do have that nice clear back, like I said, but it does have kind of this nice kind of ghost color. It's got some grays, some whites. So like I said, very much mimics the Nothing Phone 1. As you can see here, the MagSafe rings there. So it is a MagFit case from Spigen. It does say Spigen right here as far as branding goes. So we got that right there. And then there are some other things just to try to make it look like it's the internals of the device. And then looking at the actual lips around the camera bump, you can see that we do have some nice ones right there. So the lenses are nicely recessed in there. So not too shabby at all. And then just kind of touching the back, you can kind of feel the material of the different like little raised parts here. Um, so it's not completely just a smooth back. So it does add a little texture to the back when you're holding the device, so not too bad. But looking here on the side, we got our volume up and down buttons, our action button, and some Spigen branding right there, as you can see. And the buttons are nicely raised. They are clear, but they are raised, as you can see. And then moving down to the corner, you can see the air cushion technology like I was talking about. And then we do have our actual cutouts here for the USB-C charging port and our speakers. And then flipping it over to this side, you can see that we do have some lanyard holes there if you do like to use a lanyard. And then of course we have our power button, which once again is raised as you can see there. And then looking at the top, you can see once again, it says air cushion technology and we have our air cushion bumpers there on the corner. And you can kind of see the camera bump there sticking out. Now looking at the actual front of the device, you can see that we do have some nice raised lips that are going completely around the screen. So nice 360 protection with that. And then if you look at it from the top down angle, you can see that it is fairly slim. So yes, it's an ultra hybrid case. Yes, it's a zero one case, but that's the look. And then with it turned on, you can kind of see that as well. So now let's go ahead and do the actual wobble test. So if we got it face down, there is no shaking going on at all, but if we do it back down, not really much shaking going on on the sides. I mean, I can make it shake if I really want to, but it really hits that corner, and that's when it really starts to shake because of the big camera bump. So most of these cases are not anti-wobble, but at least it's not ridiculously crazy. So if you just kind of set it there and forget it, it's not gonna just be shaking on its own. And then now let's go ahead and do the clicky button test and see how responsive these buttons are. So let's do the power button first. Okay, nicely done there. Volume up and down. Okay, very clicky. And the action button. Very responsive, very easy to use. So no issues at all. So it passes the clicky button test with flying colors. Now, of course, we're going to do a MagSafe test because we got some MagFit magnets here. So let's slap it on, flip it over. And as you can see, MagSafe charging compatible. So didn't really have an issue or concern there. And the magnets are pretty strong. Obviously, with it being a MagFit case from Spigen, those magnets are going to find the MagSafe charger very nicely. So no issues at all there. And it doesn't interfere with any type of uh, Qi wireless charging or Apple Pay or anything like that. So you are good to go with any kind of contactless stuff. And you can use, obviously, MagSafe accessories in your vehicle to give you that uh, secure fit if you do kind of use it in your car. Uh, you know, no worries. It's not going to fall off or anything like that. So there we have it, guys. There is the Zero One White 
case from Spigen for the iPhone 15 Pro. And I gotta say, it's a tough choice between the two. I'm actually gonna do a, a separate video comparing the two uh, side by side so you can really get a good idea of what they look like. And if you're tossing around the idea, then at least looking at them side by side, you might be able to make that educated decision. But there's something to be said about this white one that just really stands out. It's a lot brighter. And if I was gonna buy a Nothing Phone 1, I kind of feel like I would gravitate more towards the white one, even though the newer Nothing Phone 2, uh, that darker color looks really cool. Uh, I just really think the white stands out more. But you let me know down in the comments what you think. But for the case itself, it feels good in the hand, has a nice grip because it is a clear case, so it does have kind of that gummy side. Uh, and then of course with the texture on the back, it does help a lot as well. Doesn't really attract fingerprints or smudges, so that's a good thing. But uh, yeah, guys, let me know what you think. So hit that like button if you liked the video. If you loved it, please subscribe. Ring that notification bell for up-to-date content. So be safe, God bless, we'll see you on the next one.